Good morning, guys. I just dragged myself out of bed about 10 minutes ago. Oh my God, I'm so tired. And now I am taking this guy out, really just so he can go poop. We had a couple incidents recently where he pooped in the car. <laughs> One of them in particular was really bad. But um, he gets really nervous on the way to doggy daycare, which is where he's going today. Okay, so for lunch, we have Brussels sprouts, the sweet potato and acorn squash that I roasted on Sunday, and a big hunk of salmon. I so don't want to microwave that salmon at work because I feel like when you microwave fish, it just makes the whole break room smell like fish. So I'm probably gonna eat the salmon cold. Oh, so that's lunch. And then for breakfast, I'm gonna have a banana. I'm gonna have cantaloupe and either one or two of these hard boiled eggs. And then uh, I'm gonna bring an apple for a snack. I'm so tired. It's about 7.30 now. I guess I'll finish like putting this in correct size containers and then I could sit down and have some coffee. It's gonna go right now. Hey, what are you doing? What? <laughs> It's gonna be loud in the car, I'm gonna warn you now. Why don't you sit down and wait? He's been to this doggy daycare many times. He likes it. Yeah, I don't know why he whines, but every single time we go here, he loses his mind. It's something about separation anxiety. He's like, he can't deal, because he knows that we're gonna leave. And I thought maybe since we all went together last time and like all left together, that maybe he'd be like, oh, maybe they're not gonna leave me. I think the traffic's gonna be really bad today, guys. It's not looking good. So we we're just laughing because we're in, we take the carpool lane, right? So we drive a 2002 Toyota Rav4, uh, and we were behind like a Tesla Model X and like three Chevy Volts and two BMW, what are they, i3s or something? They're all electric cars. Electric cars are allowed in the carpool lane, and so inevitably there's more electric cars in the carpool lanes than there are actual carpools. Well, first of all, there's some sort of massive thing going on because there's like a million sirens going by, but I haven't had a second to film, so I thought I'd catch you up. So today was pretty good. Wow. Right now I'm actually filling up my car with gas. We go through a lot of gas. We probably fill up like twice a week, I think. And then I'm headed down to go pick up Eric, or headed up to go pick up Eric. And luckily we don't have to stay late today. We thought we were gonna have to stay like an extra hour, but they canceled whatever meeting they were doing. So yeah, we just get to we get to pick him up, we get to leave, and then we're gonna go pick up Abe from daycare. <laughs> and then we're gonna go home. And I think Eric is actually gonna make dinner. We're having chicken and either zucchini or Brussels sprouts tonight, um, and I know he's gonna make dinner because I need to edit yesterday's San Francisco video so by now you've probably seen it and I hope you all enjoyed it I had so much fun going into the city I'm actually waiting outside of Eric's office right now I wanted to tell you that I've been trying out this <laughs> new podcast called mental illness happy hour it's interesting I'm I've, I haven't even listened to a whole one yet but um, I just want to tell you guys about it I listen to a lot of podcasts throughout the day and I'm kind of starting to transition away from like the more political ones and listen to a little bit more more of like mental illness, culture, society, like entrepreneur type stuff. But my favorite, favorite, favorite podcast, and I don't know why I love it so much. I think it's just because I love the creator behind it, Talking in Circles with Laura Miller. That's my favorite one that's like kind of focused on mental illness. I was listening to an episode today about intrusive thoughts because I have dealt with a lot of intrusive thoughts um, like my entire life. It forced me to recognize the fact that my brain does go through like 
an obsessive and compulsive cycle. So yeah, I wanna share that with you guys and I'll talk more about that in a later video. I just like, I'm just starting to learn about this so it's nothing I'm like feel comfortable making a whole video on yet. Hold on, I need to let my husband in the car. Anyways, let's go pick up Abe from daycare. Hi, buddy! Hi! 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 I hope you guys enjoyed following me around in just like a regular day in my life when I do go into like my office job down in San Jose. And if you're wondering what I do, I am actually a social media manager for a travel company. Let me know if you prefer this style of video where you just kind of like follow me throughout the day, we just chat about whatever comes up, or if you like the more focused ones like the San Francisco video, although I can't do that every day. That's a lot for every day. <laughs> Comment below and let me know and I will see you tomorrow. Okay, bye.